My teacher, my shufu is uh, Chen Yu. He's uh, the son of Chen Zhao Kui and grandson of renowned Chen Fakke from Beijing. My most important teacher in, uh, in life in general was my father, my first and best teacher. But uh, speaking about uh, Tai Chi Chuan, my most important teacher is my Shufu, uh, Master Zhou Zhongfu from Shanghai, China. My most important teacher is certainly Fernando Schidel. He is the head of the International Mazong Kuen School. I would describe my path uh, as being very unorganized but being very smoothly laid out for me so I just had to kind of walk it. I would describe it as a um, never-ending path towards self-discovery and self-cultivation. It is a path from beautiful movement through the inner work of this martial art to naturalness. That kind of depends. I would uh, either it's uh, I would take uh, Dune from Frank Herbert, which is like one of my all-time favorites. Uh, the other one is if it's more like should be more martial arts related, I would take my own book, not for narcissistic reasons, but more because I can just look up things which I forgot. It should be the eating, uh, the book of changes, because it is not for me. It's not just a book, but it's like uh, having with me. Um, thousands years old uh, a wise teacher the book i'm reading right now at this moment and if two could get in maybe the Tao Te Ching. at the moment i kind of discovered the twilight set and i quite like their song videograms well it is quite difficult to choose just one piece of music or one song um, but let's uh, randomly pick one just for a moment um, I should say life is a long song from Jethro Tal at the moment I'm playing first song by the great bassist Charlie Hayden and Abby Lincoln and I'm losing or finding myself uh, in listening Pergolesi Stabat Mata. I don't know. There are too many questions. My question is, what is the question which is moving me? Uh, it is know thyself. Just simple as that. Just two words. Like written in Delphi in ancient Greece. For a long time, and especially now, the question and the search for how I allow myself to be connected in many contexts at all. I think there are like small challenges all the time and maybe long-term challenges I don't really have anything specific at the moment I I think um, I always describe the whole concept of learning Tai Chi Chuan as like separation connection and integration and I think uh, this is what I'm always like where I'm I'm, uh, I'm in, like in between separating connecting and integrating all the time so somewhere there well the greatest challenge nowadays it is the coronavirus challenge. How to improve my pushing hands without touching anyone. In this corona time, it is in practice as in everyday life, how to find a way between adaptation and inner guidance, centering. What part of nature would I be or what? That is a very difficult question. Of course, I'm a rabbit in Chinese zodiac, as a Chinese zodiac sign. I'm a fish or Pisces in, in, in the Western. 
and maybe I'm a wolf. Lonely but quite social also. Kind of yin and yang. <laughs> well, I can say what I would love to be. Uh, I would really love to be Walter. Because this way I, I could be many, many, many different things. Steady and continuous, like a vast, uh, great big river, slowly flowing. Or I could be swift and quick, like a river turn. Mm, I could be deep and content, like uh, like the great ocean. I could be playful and joyful, like the waves on the surface of the sea. Or I would be crystal clear and calm, like the surface of, the, of a lake. Isn't it great to be water? As an animal, I would like to be a kite, German Milan. I like its elastic strength and smooth flight. <laughs>